previously on. Right. Hey, what's what up? Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Excuse me. If I told you I'm with the Minutemen, would you still want to shoot me? You're with the Minutemen? Yeah, that's I what I really said. You... Oh, hell no. I can't. No, 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 no. Woo. Woo. Hey, yo. You see Piper right here? She's wifey material. If you ever find someone who's willing to kill bugs for you, you marry them. Come out, come out. I guess we showed them. Piper, you're so impatient. You remind me of my... You remind me of someone at EdTV. <clears throat> but anyways... Hi. We could really use your help. Oh, really? I'm with the Minutemen. How can I help? Something nasty is living just around the corner from here. My it's axe? only a matter of time before there's some real trouble. What's really too bad is that it'd be a nice spot for a new settlement. In fact, I know some folks that would love to set up there if it was safe. If you can make sure the old workshop there is still in one piece, Anyone who decides to move in later will be able to rebuild. Where is this place? We have a pretty good idea. I hope you can find them and wipe them out. Okay, sweet. So in that case, um, excuse me, thank you. In that case, let's check out this settlement here and see exactly what I need to do in terms of a cleanup job. Sunshine Tidings Co-op. Damn, is all the way over there? Uh, let's go. Alright, so in terms of settlement, I don't know if you know this, just in case if you don't, in Fallout 4, you do have the ability to create new settlements after you fully take over them. And by creating new settlements, you're able to make houses, bunkers, cooking stations, etc, etc. So, we're going to go over to this area here, see what we need to do to take this place back, and then I'll actually show you a little bit on how you can build settlements. I just realized it's actually pretty quiet here. A little too quiet for the Commonwealth. I swear to god, if there's any type of fuckery that's gonna happen, pull up now. Because I'm not trying to deal with it while I'm at the settlement. Oh, shit. That's an ugly ass car. All right, we're crossing the bridge. We're almost there, I guess. Not bad. Huh. You know, before the bombs, I bet this place was very beautiful to look at. Oh shit, I knew there was some type of fuckery that's gonna happen. <sighs> Who's gonna shoot first? Anyone? You're actually gonna come to me? I'm surprised. What do you, you want? You look like you could use a little pick-me-up. Am I right? Uh, no. Sorry. Not interested. Your loss. It is my loss. Goodbye. Hands where I can see them. Bitch! Are you serious? What are you guys doing out here? We work for Stash. Wherever she goes, we go. Okay, bye. Weird ass interaction. Anyways, I thought they were gonna rob me for a second. I swear to God, I was gonna bust a cap in her ass. Is this the place? I hope so. Sunshine Tidings. Yep, here we are. This place is abandoned. Huh. 
I'm going to forget places like this even exist. Yeah, I bet. Hey! How about channeling that anger somewhere else, huh? Hey, I got you to make sure he's dead. You think I want him to come up and eat my ass? Hell no. Whoa, man. Really? Oh my. Oh my god, a hippie robot? This. This is beautiful right here. Yeah, it is. It's pretty suspicious. Question is, if something's hiding here, what is that something? You know what this place could use? Cover. Ooh, oh, cockroach! Eee! Eee! <clears throat> Thank you, Piper. I appreciate that. This is why you're my companion. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Anyways. You know, I I know what you're thinking. Why are you killing that if it's already dead? Have y'all not seen Scream? Where you think that Ghostface is dead, but he miraculously comes back to life? Sidney Prescott says, always shoot twice. So that's what I'm doing, I'm shooting twice. Ew, that nasty ass cockroach. Hey, move! Move! Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you, Piper. This is why you're here. You're awesome. Totally the best companion. Besides dog me, of course. No one can beat dog me. He's so cute and adorable. Yeah, that thing's dead. Okay, perfect. So far, so good. I don't see any weird shit going on. Hmm. And that robot is just chilling there. Como si now? Yeah, bitch. When Oh shit, it's coming out! Ah! Shit. Shit, 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 this is bad. I'm sorry if I shot you, Piper. Are you okay? Oh my god. I did a shot her. Okay. Bottle cap. A settler. Oh shit, that sucks. Hell yeah. Oh my god, it's Ed, Ed, and Eddie! Wow, buddy, good for you. Look at you being famous. Good Maybe for you. trying to kill us, but Commonwealth never lacks for excitement. Huh. I wish... I wish I can e easily say that without any PDSD type of fear, but okay. Good for you. Alright, let's see what's in this bad boy. Huh. It's dead. Sweet. Sweet. Alright. I mean, I don't see any crazy stuff here besides cockroaches, but... and ferals. Ew. Ew. That's right. You see? I'm happy. Killing cockroaches makes me happy because those sons of bitches are so nasty, I swear to god. Really? Ah. <sighs> Boy, do I hate lock picking. Sweet. I really do. But for some, for some reason, Piper likes it when I like lock pick. I don't know why. Ooh, bourbon. I got us a little bit of a drinky drink. Hey. So, this mission is relatively easy. Like, what's the catch? Eesh. Anyways. Oh shit, two! Alright, see? Not bad. Damn, I blew f its fucking legs out. So I guess this was just a pretty easy mission. No bullshit, no sudden plot twist, nothing. Hmm. I'm not used to this. 
The workshop allows you to build, adjust, and remove nearby objects and structures. Move between options with left arrow and right arrow. Press up arrow to find the object or structure you wish to build. If your selected object appears green, press X to build it. If it appears red, try adjusting its location and yours until it changes to green. Workshop objects are built from components. When building an object, components are automatically harvested from junk items in your inventory or the workshops. Okay, so let's say you want to build something. You would press down, you press down and hold on the D-pad until this menu pops up. And you notice how throughout the whole settlement there's this green line that is outlining. The green, the green line is, sh is what shows you the areas you're able to build. So anything that's inside the green line, you're able to either build something, delete, add, all that stuff. If you get past the green line, not only do you see the red line, but the workshop mode would exit after a certain amount of time. So anything that's inside the green, it's okay to build. Anything that's outside the green is now okay to build. All right, so let's get back to the resident here and tell him the good news. All right, where is she? Ah, there you go. Hey, hey, hey. You're back. Any luck clearing up that trouble spot? Um, I was about to say something to you walked away, but okay. I cleared that place out for you. Should be safe for your friends to move in now. Nice to have some good news around here for a change. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. Yes. We've got to help each other if we want things to get better. All right. We had two settlements wanting to support the Minutemen now. This is good news. Let's go to Preston and see what else he has for us in store. Hello, Preston. Where is this cowboy? Mom, He's just sitting there. Back, uh, what? I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Congo. Uh, yeah, buddy, I did actually. You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed, I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Ah, uh, you're so cute, but no, not now. All right then. Anyways, don't get me wrong. I know Codsworth can be a good companion, but right now I have Piper here already, and so far she's been pretty good to me. I like that. I like that detail of how Preston's just coming to himself but then again why is he by himself sitting there fucking weirdo things are tough now but they'll get better okay the Minutemen are on a roll I helped that settlement you sent me to and cleared the way for a new settlement in the process that's fantastic news we're gonna take back the whole commonwealth from the bad guys at this rate anyway I'm glad you're here something else has come up what our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement the trouble is that some kind of vicious beasts are layering there. Once you clear it out, set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth, one piece at a time. All right, bet. Awesome. So there's another settlement for me to use. Damn, Piper, look at you. Running like a quarterback, you good? Hey, just let me know. Alright, but anyways, I know these Minimint quests can be a little bit redundant, especially with the whole concept of save this, rebuild structure, blah blah blah, but at the end of the day, I definitely want to get some brownie points from Preston, especially since he made me as a general, so I might as well just exercise the title while I'm at it, you know? Um, alright, let me just... See Mama Murphy. Hey, girl. Sanctuary. I knew you'd join us here, kid. 
Your energy is tied to this place. That's because I used to live here, buddy. I used to live here. A long time ago. Ah, but the distant past ain't so distant for you. I saw you leave that icebox. This whole world is like some bad dream you can't wake up from, isn't it? <laughs> Sounds the like my life. I can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. Uh, excuse me, ma'am? How about no? Here. No! I already have some. Oh, shit! Like a little kick yourself, huh? Oh, this fuck. Do. Now, let me ride the high to where the sight wants to take me. I didn't mean you're to. Walking <sighs> into a sea. Uh -huh. But it's not water you're afraid of drowning in. It's something invisible. But radiant. It burns everything in it. But, no, I can feel them. There's people calling out to something, chanting. They can show you the way, but they're so hard to read. Be careful around them, kid. Phew, wow. That took more out of me than usual. I'm gonna need to rest now, kid. Okay, I accidentally gave this old hag some drugs. I'm so sorry. What the hell? But I noticed how she mentioned something about the sea. Is she actually talking about the glowing sea? And if so, what people? Because as far as I'm concerned, from what I remembered, wasn't Virgil the only person in that supposed glowing sea? Like, who else is in there? I'm sorry, Piper. That was by mistake. Stop blaming me. Anyways, let's go to this place. Let me take a look here. Starlight Drive-In. Ooh, a drive-in movie theater? Hell yeah, I want to go. Okay, so from what I'm seeing on this map here, the drive through movie theater is down behind this town. So let's go. Man, I just love when it's sunset. I mean, look at that. Where's the sun? Like, this... This is beautiful. The different hues of the orange, red, a little bit yellow. Man. Honestly, if the apocalypse never happened... I bet this would be beautiful to walk through with its greenery, beautiful flower trees and everything. Damn. Alright, so I- ew, what the fuck? Oh no. Oh my god, no. No, 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 no. No, you get over with! I don't wanna deal with that shit! Oh shit, no! Piece of shit. Nasty ass mosquito. Oh my god. I would never want to live in Fallout 4 because just by seeing these giant mosquitoes alone, I, that would be my 13th reason. Dead ass. That would be my 13th reason. Not the mutant feral ghouls, not the mutant cockroaches, not even the scorpions or the mole rats. It's the mosquitoes. That would be my 13th reason. Because I hate mosquitoes with a pat. Oh, come on. Oh, clearly. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Stop it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, bro. This is too much. Like. Oh, my God. The radiation's killing us. Oh my god, I just... Okay, 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 okay. First of all, let me get my rat away. Rat away. Take some rat away. Okay, so, yeah. This is beautiful. So, we cleared out everything. 
The radio is playing, even though there's no one here. Like, whatever. Um, right. Let me see here. Time for me to lockpick as usual. This is like Skyrim all over again. Got it. Yay! So remember how I mentioned earlier where you're able to add in stuff? Well, in this particular mission, we're going to go ahead and create some sort of a beacon. That way, settlers would come to this area and start populating. So, let me see here. Where would this beacon be? Bell, siren. Um, hold on. I'm trying to figure out where this beacon is. Hold on. Structures, maybe? Miscellaneous, maybe? It's been a while. Damn, I don't even know. Crafting? No. Damn, where is this beacon? Hold on. No, this is cages. Hold on, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Stores, maybe? Nah, it wouldn't be here. It has to be under resources. Alerts nearby settlers to danger when triggered. But the thing is, I'm not trying to make a siren. Hold on. Maybe- wait, wait! It has to be under power. It has to be. There you go. So this is what we need to build. A recruitment radio beacon. So let me see here. I'll just place it right here. Now the thing is, being that this requires one electricity, I also need to build some sort of a generator with it so it'll start working, so... Great. Where is the generator? Come on, stop playing. Power... Ah, there you go. Let me do this little small generator here. Now, in order to connect these two together, you would need to... Click on the triangle and automatically a wire would appear. So you just connect that bad boy to here, attach it with the triangle button again, and bada boom bada bang. Once it's the electricity side is highlighted in green, it means that it's working. Alright. Beautiful. So now that is settled, let's go back to Preston. All right, Vamanos. All right, all right. Where is Preston? I swear to God, if he's hiding in the dark like an emo. He's hiding in the dark like an emo. Oh my God, is this what you do all day, Preston? Like, really? Hey. I cleared out that spot you sent me to and set up a radio beacon there. That's great news. Once folks have some place to call their own, They'll be willing to help defend it. As usual, I have something else for you to look into. Of course you do. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all our settlements. It's a good problem to have, and I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the castle. The it castle? It used to be the Minuteman HQ, way before my time. Well fortified, centrally located, and most important, it has a powerful radio transmitter we can use to broadcast to the whole Commonwealth. So what happened to this castle if it was so well fortified? This was long before I joined up, but the story I heard was that some kind of monster came out of the sea and destroyed the fort. A Damn. lot of the leaders were killed in that battle, and I guess nobody ever felt it was worth the risk to try to retake it. I've always wondered if losing the radio station was the beginning of all our later problems. So, should I have an assault force assemble near the castle? Hell yeah, let's yeah. go. Let's do this. We'll do some recon and meet you outside the castle. See you there. Holy shit. They got a castle, Piper. This shit's dope. Yo. 
I knew it! I knew it was good to do the Minutemen quest! A castle, bro! A castle! Look at Piper just drinking. Hey! Shoot! Hey, Piper. Mm, time for some travel fuel. Want one? Your thoughts? Huh, hard to believe I'm roaming with my own pre-war relic. Uh, excuse me? Pre-war relic? Are things alright between us? Things are pretty good from where I'm standing. So long as we're helping people out here, I'm all in. Okay. I'm glad to oh, hear that. Nothing. Sure. She called me a pre-war relic. Uh, <laughs> Alright. Let's go to the castle? Where is this castle? All the way over there. Damn! Okay. I guess we can travel, right? Alright, let's go. Alright, so we're in downtown Commonwealth. And let's go to the castle. There is a dead buddy on the left. Oh. And the radar will scum somewhere. Come on. We don't have to this. <laughs> oh, come on. Are you serious? You know what? I'm tired of these bitch ass raiders. Come here. Boom, baby. Who the hell is shooting me? What a whore. Look at this. Come here. Anyways. You two, get some. Alright, what's next? Comeback zone. The hell is a comeback zone? Wish it had come to that. Tommy's rule number two? No caps, no entry. What the hell is this? Fight club? Hold on. Do I have something here about... Oh, I do. Huh. Well, Piper, the castle's gonna have to wait. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.